It's a Hellcat now. Comments don't be moving me. Fuckers, they gonna do to me. <laughs>
shift is low. So as you can see, your boy beat Corey, but uh, a quick, a quick, a quick uh, disclaimer. The first two times you see me race, uh, Corey was using his pedal shifters, um, so he wasn't shifting good. But that last time, he actually jumped, but we still ran it, and I beat him. It was another guy that was in the streets that has a uh, Hellcat Red Eye Charger. Um, I didn't get to record that video, but a lot of people think my car is tuned, but hey, if it is, it is. If it's not, it's not. I'm not going to tell you. If you see me on the streets, you just have to figure it out one way or another, but I know for sure I beat Corey, and Corey has beaten a uh, red eye, factory red eye charger, so is my stuff tuned? When it comes to the performance stuff, I'm not going to say nothing. If if it is tuned, it is tuned. If it's not tuned, it's not tuned. But hey, if you come across me on the streets and we do a little quick run, we do a quick run. You know what I'm saying? So, with that being said, man, Corey Craft Fast, eventually he's going to take off those 26s one day. Y'all hear that? I don't know, it's not like that mosquito truck. But eventually he's gonna take out the 26s one day. I honestly don't know when he's gonna do it, but he's gonna take them off. And Corey, Corey Carr is pushing, guys, probably, he has to be pushing at least 850 to the wheel. 850 to the wheel, so. Um, but the difference between me and Corey's car I have 22s, air suspension, which probably can help out a little bit because my car is lower than his. He has 26s, that's heavy as hell, and he got a heavy box in the damn trunk. So that's what hurts him. And eventually what's gonna happen with Corey, man, I, I don't know if he knows this or not, but eventually he's gonna go through, he's gonna go through tires too much because of the tune. He's gonna start popping. Um, he's gonna start popping them tires real soon. Um, uh, if you believe it or not, it's gonna happen. Um, it's just because it's too much power, and the tires are this thin, and that's the downfall about having big wheels with a tune. You can run big tires, big, uh, but you're gonna have to change the tire. I mean, you can run big wheels, but you're gonna have to change the tires out a lot. So. Um, eventually he's going to have to, something's going to happen bad. He's going to end up going to have to go with smaller wheels. Um, I keep telling him that he wants to go 24s. I keep telling him to go 22s because you have thicker tire. Um, if you look at my wife's freaking room right here, these are 22s. And look how thick these tires, these are the same exact tires I have on my uh, Hellcat as well. And look how much meat is on there. You know what I'm saying? So those are Arturo tires. It, it'd be smart for him to go 22s if he goes 24s and if he if he takes his redo his spindles and all that he's still gonna have thin tires because with 26s he has thin tires because he lifted it if he takes the lift off he's still gonna have to go thin tires with 24s so it's really smart for him to go 22s or 20s um but I don't know. Corey is his own man. He can do what he want to do. Um, but hey, I want to. I want to. I want to run it again though. But without him doing the damn paddle shifters though, like leave the damn paddle shifters alone. I just want to run a straight race. Uh, if he take off his twenty sixes, he will smoke me badly. I want to tell y'all that now. But if he leave his twenty sixes on there, I'm pretty sure I win. Uh, most definitely. But hey.
Corey's competitive, I'm competitive. Uh, we just have to wait and see that time come. But other than that, man, this is going to be the end of the video. Hopefully you saw the fight in the race and you enjoyed it. I just got back from actually in Mexico racing him. And I just want to end the video. But other than that, man, I'm in my own lane doing my own thing, man. Peace. That's all, folks.